Who's in charge? The government? The Prime Minister? The Queen? Your manager at work? Your dad? Your wife? You? Who is truly in charge? Well, our special prayer for this week, the Collect, reminds us of the one who governs all things and who governs all things everywhere, both in heaven and on earth. He doesn't just reign for four years, but for eternity. He isn't voted in for a democratic process and neither does he rule as part of an oppressive regime. He is both able to govern all things perfectly and at the same time allow us the freedom to make our own choices and decisions. God Almighty is his name. Any human government can be accused of making mistakes, changing its mind, floundering, underreacting, overreacting, being too fast, being too slow, spending too little, spending too much. But Almighty God governs perfectly everywhere and all the time. There isn't a single detail in your life unknown to God. There isn't a single concern too insignificant for him. There isn't a single burden too much for him. God knows everything, understands everything, cares about everything, is concerned about everything and governs everything, even if you don't notice it. So be encouraged today that God is the governor. He's in charge. He's in control. Place yourself under his governorship today. Pray that the choices you make will be directed by him. Pray that he will be the governor of your life. There's no greater person to govern our lifestyle, our plans, our behaviours, than your mighty and everlasting God. Let's pray. Almighty and everlasting God, who does govern all things in heaven and on earth, mercifully hear the supplications of thy people and grant us thy peace all the days of our life. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen.